The world was supposed to end. Yesterday. I'm recording this on Friday, October 28th, but I'm going to upload it October 29th. One guy, uh, I don't know who his name is, I don't know where he's from, what his belief is, I'm sorry for the lack of references, but he believed the Mayan calendar was supposed to end today, or yesterday, I guess, October 28th. He said that, that the Mayan calendar is going to end, he's one of those new age fellows, and he says, and that's it. It's not October, or it's not December 21st of 2012, it's October 28th, 2011. Now I love, I love this, people keep setting dates, dates all the time, for this, that, end of the world, darkness, blah blah blah, that's nothing. We're supposed to also have three days of darkness on October 28th till October 30th, 31st, but, uh, looks pretty sunny outside. People keep setting dates, I don't know why, and it just makes them look like fools. Like, the world's going to end, the rapture, three days of darkness, uh... Jesus is going to come down in his underpants and spank everybody. And it never happens. And then that person just looks like an idiot. And they're like, Phew. and they just discredit them. One guy predicted the end of the rapture three times. Failed all the time. A bunch of people predicted aliens coming October 14th since 2008. They're like, oh, they're coming in 2008. 2009. 2010. Oh, they'll definitely be here 2011. And the next year, they'll be like, they're coming to save us now. It's got to be because the end of the world is coming. It has to be last chance. It's like, they're, they're, they're going to be wrong, likely. Now, I don't put a lot of faith in these events. Somebody says the world's going to get three days of darkness. I look into it, see if there's any physical evidence to support this conclusion. Usually I don't find any, and then I believe, okay, it's pretty unlikely that we're going to experience three days of darkness, but hey, it's a possibility. You never know. Just by one of those fluke chances, somebody could be right. I doubt it. Now, it's interesting, if, if you're a religious person, you know in the Bible it says uh, God's day will come like a thief in the night. So, if everybody in the entire world is predicting a day the world will end, and we're, you know, there's seven billion humans on this planet as of October 30th or something, so if everybody was predicting the end of the world, like every day, and firmly believed the world would end on that day for like the next 40, 50 years, would God's day never really come? Because if we all expect it, then when it comes, then somebody will be like, I knew that was coming. And somebody will probably have believed that that day was the day as well, so it would be like a couple people knew it was going to come. So that would kind of disprove that God's day will come and no one will know it, or no one will be able to predict, I, I don't know. If we constantly predict, will it just never come? I don't know. So, dates. People, stop setting a date, please. Unless you've got hard ass evidence. Even the Mayan calendar ending on December 21st or 24th, I think it's the 21st. I don't believe the world's gonna end, but I believe it's gonna be the start of a huge catastrophic shift in the way that we as humans work, live, everything. Like, it's not gonna be the end of the world, but it's gonna be a mad change. And I one date to actually look forward to, if you're ever into sacred geometry and the flower of life, uh, the number 11, 1111, you know, like make a wish, it's 1111. It's apparently like a sacred number. And on a lot of crop circles, 1111 has shown up on these crop circles. Now, it's interesting to think this next month is November, and the 11th day of the 11th month of the 11th year of the new century is November 11th, 2011. I'm not saying anything's going to happen. Some people are, are saying, of course, that it's going to be the day that uh, either the heavens, apparently the heavens is another dimension, like a couple feet above our heads, and it's going to open up and, you know, we're all going to receive the Holy Spirit, or we're all going to reach uh, the spiritual ascension that we sh should have been years ago, but we fell back into the dark ages. You know, there's a few theories on what's going to happen. Personally, I'm not putting any solid faith in any, but like if it happens, okay, it happens. I kind of had an idea that it might. If not, whatever. But I think something might happen because, like, how often does 11 11 11 come up? Or even 11 11. You know, November 11th of the 11th year. So keep your eyes open, your ears open for anything that happens on November 11th. If you hear of anything catastrophic, amazing, intense, like natural disaster, or Obama was shot at 11 p or 11 a.m on the 11th day of the 11th month of the 11th year, which equals 44, Obama's the 44th president. I just came up with that and I thought maybe, maybe, you never know, he's black, somebody should have assassinated him by now. But anyway, that's that. Oh, new video, coming up, yesterday. Ha, <laughs> you've probably already seen it. World War III, yeah. That's right, bitches, World War III. I hope you have canned goods and a rifle ready.